everyone, today we are here for the first event of season two of the Major League Marvels. This is going to be the summer season. It's going to go all throughout the summer because summer started two days ago. Um, the last one was the spring season for 2021. Uh, I didn't do a winter one, but uh, yeah, so you may be thinking, why well, is the tiny track up here to the last one? No, this is our main track. This is our main track. So we have two tracks. One's going to be for if we do like a short race. We're just going to do that. And then this is going to be our main track. So I'll give you a rundown real quick. We have the starting gate, which I can open this as well. Then we have the dividers, and I tested this. It is very even, so it can, it, it's probably going to go. Like, I did an eight marble test three times. Every time, four went this side, four went that side, and the funnels are pretty even as well. So that's pretty cool. Um, But this one is a lot more, like, straight on, kind of, like, follow behind them instead of funnels. Like last time, I know what season three's track is gonna be, so I'm excited about that. But uh, yeah, so then you have the zigzag straightaways. There you go, this way and then this way and then back this way and into the funnels. Same on this side. Then you have a little bit of a drop, but that's only to make. But I ran it out of like things to put there to keep like distracting the thing that we're even keep distracting the marbles. So I just put those there, and I mean it works. So yeah. Put those drops in, and, uh, yeah, actually, hold on. Actually, no, they're All right, anyway, that's what I was saying. So then we have the same kind of connecting thing. We have these dividers. Then they come down into the blue curve, and then into the spiral thing. So when they get here, they're going to get into the, one of these sections, which in this case would be this one, and they will go around, and this will kind of push them. So I'll go down the spinner section, into the S-curve, down the Ferris Wheel of Death. They actually go uphill a little bit here, which is kind of cool. Down the stairs, and then into the final two funnels. And then over here is our main track. We have three funnels, the spiral, the loop, and we're into the final funnel. So, this is the division event. And you may be wondering, how did you split these up into three divisions? Well, let me tell you. We have... The eight marbles that made the playoffs last year. Eight marbles that didn't make the playoffs last year. And then the eight new marbles. So it was pretty simple. And, uh, yeah, so another thing is that is, so here's how this event's going to work. We're going to have the top four marbles from each group. We're going to do one race, top four for each division. Top four, move on to the next part. In the next round, and there will, there will be 12. And then we're going to do a quick race on this track because the bottom, the last two marbles to finish actually won't get be getting points because only 10 marbles will get points per event. Now, also keep in mind, this is a season-long point standings, no playoffs, no nothing. So there is that. I might do the playoffs next year, but I'm going to try uh, the season-long point standing thing for two years, see how that works. But, uh... Yeah, so then we're going to have a two marble elimination here from any division. We're just going to send them all down. And then it's going to be the final ten. They're going to be fighting for how many points they get. I think you get the idea. So, let's do this. So, starting off, we have... Hmm. Any, mini money, mo. I pick you. Now, let's go. Marbles have to not make the playoffs last year. This consists of Vampire, Thunderbird, who actually won an event... In the play during the playoffs, and I didn't play off marble, unfortunately. Penguin, Scorpion, Circus, Peacock, Blue Oil, and Parrot. So let me just quickly take that down. Okay. Here they go. They're off and down and into the funnel. It is four and four. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. This is pretty even divider here. Neck and neck. Penguin has the lead. Keep in mind the top four fans. Scorpion and Blue will go down at pretty much identical time. Scorpion gets stuck, and Vampire has jumped off track. Now I'm going to put him back on the piece where he was at. Here they go down the mechanical section, really. Top four right now is Thunderbird, Blue Oil, Scorpion, and Penguin. But much more are coming. And in fact, I believe all of them are now down here. Vampire's made quite the comeback. And I believe we have a marble stuck somewhere, or maybe off the track. 
Don't know for sure, but Thunderbird and Beluga Whale are gonna be the first two. Vampire third and Parrot's gonna take fourth. Penguin's gonna squeeze out fifth. Parrot will take sixth, but we have two marbles stuck. No circuit, but we're seventh at. Or eighth. Oh, that's gonna be Peacock. Apparently he was stuck on the spinny wheel thing. So the four marbles that will be eliminated in this round are Peacock, Circus, Scorpion, and Penguin. They will not be getting points this round, so we can just put them in there. Before moving on, will be Thunderbird, Beluga Whale, Vampire, and Pear. Vampire will be quite the comeback, coming all the way from dead last after, not really, didn't actually, it was like six. From after falling off the track and then came back to get third. So that was a pretty good comeback there for Vampire. All right, next up, let's see what we do. Any, me, me, my, Nemo, I pick you. Now let's go. New marbles. All right, here are the new marbles. Here I'm going to go across and down. So we have police officer, werewolf, polar bear, race car, golden viper, zebra, snowball, and python. So let's see what can, let's see what they happen what happens here. There they go down the straight line, zigzags, and we're off. Snow, snowball, race car, werewolves, and the police officer looks like they're going to be leading them down into the final funnel here. Pretty quick time to get down there as Golden Viper is last. They're all of them but race cars seem to be in the orange funnel now as race car gets stuck. Police officer and race car going in and the final funnel werewolf and snowball will join them. Python and Golden Viper come down and they make a big hit on them. And some of the marbles down there they might be able to move on now. Seabird gets stuck. Snowball's first. Python second. Werewolf third. And race car fourth. A mix up at the end. They're just going to eliminate police officer. Unfortunately, it's going to eliminate police officer, golden viper, polar bear, and zebra. Those four marbles are now out. These four marbles are in. Snowball, python, uh, werewolf, and race car. All right. Last group in the vi early division up is the uh, Marbles that made the playoffs last year. So the uh, it's also kind of cool because then you can rank. All right, all right, these are the ones who made the playoffs, so we know they were probably pretty good in the season. The other, the group we did before, or the first the first group we did was the Marbles that didn't make the playoffs. So we're like, okay, they probably weren't as great that season, but they still could have been good. Like Thunderbird, he won an event. Blue Will turned it on after the playoffs started. But uh then we have the latest group we just did. It was full of the new marbles. We don't know what they could have done last year because they weren't in it. So it's kinda cool how it goes like that. Alright. Playoff marbles are off and racing. They aren't in the playoffs now. This is the start of season two. It's a full season on point stand. There's no playoffs or anything. White Swirl has the lead, followed up by Stingray, Owl, and Robot. Galaxy's fifth and gets stuck. Serpent and Jungle come down next, and Tiger Shark being stuck in the dividing funnels. And we have a four card train in the bottom orange funnel. Actually, the only one orange funnel. So Tiger Shark struggles on that dividing. Path now down the mechanical section into the S, into the Ferris wheel of doom and death. Makes it through. Stingray are champions. We're a former champion is fifth right now, defending champ. Who's gonna win the race? White Swirl followed by Serpent. Owl. Oh, and Robot just beats out Galaxy. Stingray's gonna come down seventh. This is gonna eliminate Galaxy, Stingray, Jungle, and Tiger Shark. White Swirl, Serpent. Owl and Robot are going to be moving on. All right, now we take these 12 
put them on the mini track. The bottom two, the last two marbles to finish are out. Oh boy, that doesn't count. Here they go, they're all going for it. White squirrel lead, followed by Python and much more are coming. Right now it looks like Owl's last up there, but I don't know for sure. Yep, it's Owl and Parrot that are last right now. Meanwhile, Blue Go Whale leads them down. Followed by Werewolf and Python. Too new, too old, lead them. Then Robot comes in. Werewolf seems to have the lead, but Blue Go Whale moves them out of the way at the last second. Take the lead. And Werewolf is coming after him quickly, too. They battle in the final funnel. Owl and Parrot are still dead last back there. Blue Go Whale will take the win, followed by Robot. Snowball, Sting, or Werewolf. White Swirl, Thunderbird, Python. Owl and Parrot are still stuck back there. Bad on the last two. We have a race car, Serpent. It comes down to Vampire and Parrot, which it's definitely going to go to... Uh, Vampire right there. Let me just make sure none are stuck, none are. Those two are eliminated. All right, so here's how the points are going to work here. So I'm just going to make a random line and, and say that's the points. All right. One, two, three, four, five, seven, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. So it goes one, two, three, four, five, seven, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. So that's how it's gonna go. We have 10 marbles up here. We're gonna eliminate, it's now it's just gonna be single. Actually, no. Yeah, that's right, we're gonna, yeah, I remember I was gonna do this now. Okay, so it's gonna be double elimination. And how are we gonna determine the points? Well, whoever finishes ahead of the other is getting eliminated. So, as I drop blue oil, <laughs> let's do this. On straight line zigzags and into the divider funnels. They are off and it's five and five in each one. I'm telling you, this is the most even thing yet. Because last season they were all going to one side. White Swirl leads over Serpent. Robot in race car. Well, the whale's also there in a big collision. That right hand in the right side green funnel. Right now it's Python and Snowball who are in the back. Nope, that's Vampire. My bad. Vampire and Python are hard to tell. Hard here. Snowball struggles up there. Meanwhile, Serpent has the lead. We'll go well, Werewolf, Race Car, Robot, and more are still coming. Right now, it's Vampire and Snowball who are in the back. Here's Blue Oil's already won the race. He's safe. Python and Serpent are next. The Snakes are joining forces. And we have a uh, Race Car. Followed up by Werewolf, Robot, Vampire. And White Swirl, which will illuminate Thunderbird and Snowball here. And Thunderbird clearly finished at a Snowball. So Snowball, the new one of the new marbles. How many new marbles made it? Four of them. So half of the new marbles actually made it. It's pretty impressive. Alright, so as we go over here, first point of the season is going to go to Snowball. But that first point is only one point. So that's unfortunate. Alright. Thunderbird has two points to start the season, so he is actually going to start out as the season points leader. He's going to be the first points leader, at least, but that isn't going to last for long here because we have, we're going to have two more marbles get eliminated here. So we are already down to only eight. Who is going to win the season opener? Last season it was Stingray. He's out, so we're going to have a new season uh, opening winner. By the way, last season, the season opener won the championship. Just saying, could be, could be big. We win it. Down the, uh, down the straight line stairs, and they are off, and I believe we have a marble stuck. Nope. No, we do not. I just remembered we shrunk the field down. All right. Serpent, werewolf, vampire, and python lead. Right now, it's race car and white swirl to our last. 
Ace card's gonna try to catch you up here with White Swirl right behind him. Neck and neck down here. Great card makes a big hit. Beluga Whale leads, followed up by Serpent. Werewolf. Race cars made a comeback. It's not gonna be enough to get up there. There we go. Robots now last. He finished the runner up in the championship last year. There we go. Vampire and Python take the win. One spot remains. Serpent takes it. Race car would have gotten in, but I don't know if you saw it. He had a he messed he made a little bit of a mistake, just a rookie mistake, and it's gonna cost him big time here. So there goes another two of the new marbles. So out of the four new marbles, three of them are already out in the first two rounds. Race car and werewolf are the next two out. So werewolf is gonna get three points while race car takes four. Definitely gonna be an intro. This is getting interesting already. So. So ten. Alright, so it's gonna be a little more over, but that's fine. Snowball's gonna have one point, so the the points are gonna be a little more over, but that's fine. Give me more over on the note. Oh, that's fine. Alright, so snowball one. So race car becomes the second point spear of the season. But once again, that's not going to last for long. Here we go. We're going to eliminate another two this time. Let's see what it's going to be. Just remember, whoever won the season, my season, the winner of the season opener, which is this event, is, uh, well, it wasn't the exact same event, but you get the point. They, uh, they won it all, so... Just saying. And what's this? Oh, we have a plot twist event. Five races. The middle race is going to go on this tiny track. See what happens. Alright. Same rules apply, just a different track. Just split up the, uh, the two races on the big track. We have Python, Blue Whale, Robot. Vampire top four. It's the top four that make it. Serpent and White Swirl are last. There they go. Oh, it's neck and neck right now. Neck and neck. Robot Lee's heading into the final. Funnel, can he secure a spine to the final four? Python's right behind him, tries to make a move, but it's gonna be Robot taking the W. Oh, Vampire makes a move on Python here, he's gonna be second. Serpent and White Swirl are still up there. Python's definitely coming third, and Blue Whale is gonna take an easy fourth place, even with Serpent just coming in now. Blue Whale, easy. Ali ahead. Alright, I kind of messed up Serpent right there, but that's fine. He's still going to finish out of White Swirl, most likely. Alright, Serpent still finishes ahead. Now I don't feel bad. <laughs> Whoa, we got a bouncer. Alright, that's fine. 
So wait, Swirl is gonna take five points. Not bad, it's not bad. Five points, and then Serpent is going to take seven. All right. Four marbles remain. Now, what points you can get if you're in this final four set of marbles? It's ten points, which is a solid start. You're starting in the double digits. Will it be Robot? Vampire, Python, or Beluga Whale? Which one will take it all? Find out shortly. Here we go. Neck and neck, side by side. Only the top two will make it. And they're neck and neck on either side. Beluga Whale and Vampire have the lead. Python gets stuck. Serves the five second penalty. He is pretty far behind now because of that, unfortunately, though. Oh, and gets stuck again. Five second penalty is uh, Python's pretty much eliminated now. Ooga Whale and Robot. Robot's coming quick into that funnel. Holy moly. Vampire and Robot's really the only battle left here is Blue Whale. Takes the spot. Vampire going for it. It's not quite gonna happen. He makes a move and it happens. Robot gets to take it away from him again. In the final funnel, and he has a chance to win something big, like in a like an entire event, which he still hasn't done. He just gets moved out of the way at the last second. That's unfortunate for Robot. Is always coming third or second. I feel, I feel like he's gonna get a win this season. But man, that's just unfortunate for him. So Python's gonna start off the season with a solid 10 points, Robot with an even solider 15. Alright, question is who gets. Who gets, uh. Mm -hmm. Who gets 20? Who gets 25? Vampire or Blue the Whale? They are both going for their first career win. Who's going to get it? So maybe the favorite for the championship right here. Remember what I said earlier? I'm going to say it again. I know we're to the bunch. Winner of the season opener last season, Stingray. Who was the champion last year? Stingray. Oh, Blue Whale caught up during that down the down, downstairs, downstairs a uh, straight line. Can Vampire catch up? Doesn't look like it. It looks like Blue Whale has the lead, and he does. Vampire's trying to close in. He's gaining big time on Blue Whale. Here they go, final two funnels. This orange funnel is almost like quicksand. It slows them down a lot compared to the speed they had in this section. Vampire tries making a move. He tries doing the same thing he did on Robot earlier. Doesn't work on Blue Whale here. Blue Whale pulls away. He is so close to winning a couple events last year near the end of the playoffs. Can he finally get the win or will Vampire steal another one? He's going to steal another one. What a move. And Vampire's going to take the season opener win. Vampires are here for blood, and he's actually taking it. Pun not intended. I mean, it kind of was intended, but it also wasn't. Like, I realized it when I was half saying it, and I could have stopped. Okay, I think you get the idea. It kind of was, but it kind of wasn't. Vampires stealing two souls in one. Even I think he even took a couple of wires with him from Rolla. We'll have to make sure that uh, he's doing some legal moves there. But what a move. It looked like Beluga Whale had his first win in sight. First win ever in sight. Just could not quite finish it up. Just like Robot. They've both have been coming runner up quite a bit lately. It, it, they gotta be getting a win soon. Wow, that was a crazy finish. 
two times in a row, Vampire just stole, stole a spot, or in Blue Oil's case, a win away from another marble. So let's go over to the point standings here for the first for the first event. On 16, Vampire has a points lead only by five over Blue Oil. Who has a five point lead over Robot, who has a five point lead over Python, who has a three point lead over Serpent, who has a two point lead over White Swirl, and then after that it's only a one point gap. And there are now Race Car with four, Werewolf with three, Thunderbird with two, and Snowball with one. So that's gonna wrap it up for the season opener. Definitely a crazy finish there at the end. And again, Vampire uses to his advantage. Will the season opening curse stay?